Bob and Regina Zellerbach. Of course I know these two. Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises. You can't trust anyone in Gotham. Least of all those you call friend. Your parents learned that the They're waiting for you in hell! Then it just felt light. Like I could do whatever I wanted. No guilt, no consequence. Cobblepot wants retribution because we took his family's land. Your father, Falcone, and I, we had ways of getting anything we wanted. How do you think your family got the land for Wayne Tower? But what would Harvey think? The two of us, working together? Are we alone? Yeah, we're, we're alone. Oof, we, we, we should go. Keep on doing what you're doing, and the rest of Gotham will start to see you like I do. A hero. So sorry, ladies and gents. As you might have guessed, there's been a change to tonight's program. Uh, we need a new moderator. You there? Do. Yes! You. Thank you for volunteering. My downtrodden brothers and sisters of Gotham, you have nothing to fear. We are the children of Arkham. Mr. Dent. Thank you. Before Catwoman becomes two faced. Gotham is still reeling after last week's mayoral debate. With the drugging and subsequent murder of Mayor Hamilton Hill, Harvey Dent was left running unopposed. After a rather lackluster election, Bruce, was finally, a friendly bed. face. Is, he's still being held for observation. Meanwhile, it's good to see you. Congratulations, Mayor Dent. How does it feel? Oh, it'd feel better if I were out of here. I'm ready to get back into it. Oh, what have you got there? I, uh... <laughs> I brought you some flowers. Though I see I'm not the first. Yeah, well, Hi, my mother and my secretary. Ugh, every sick boy's dream. <laughs> One woman I thought would visit, or at least call, hasn't. Selena's been a no-show. I thought she'd at least come by to congratulate me, if nothing else. Guess we weren't as close as I thought. Maybe she just saw me being a coward. Oh shit, I already paid him two hours ago. And I don't care, It surprises honest. me. You two seemed... friendly. Yeah, I thought so. But this disappearing act seems to say otherwise. I am glad you're here, though. God, it's been infuriating. Sitting here and having nothing but time to think about what happened. I wish I could make myself turn it off completely. Watching footage of the debate over and over. Penguin would have just beaten me to death right there in front of everyone. He wanted to. I mean, if Batman hadn't been there, I would be. I was helpless, Bruce. Helpless. Couldn't do anything. Batman was the one who stepped up. I mean, he's the reason I'm sitting here. No one else even did a damn thing. Hey. Thanks. What they did to Hill, to the moderator. I have to live with that. But you heard them up there. The penguin and that maniac on screen. Oh, this isn't over. I need to stay ahead of them. They're trying to cause discord. That stunt at the debate was just the first step. Gotham is in real danger. All the more reason for me to stand up this, tonight this and give gets, the gets people hope. With every episode. Of course, the doctors aren't thrilled about me leaving. My therapist is worried the drug might have caused some issues to resurface. Uh, make them unmanageable. She wants me to take it easy. To go slow. I mean, that's impossible, right? 
I gotta be able to take it easy. How am I supposed to do that? We all have demons, Harvey. Yeah. Isn't that the truth? Honestly, I'm fine. Besides, I know I'm not the only one dealing with the fallout from that debate. I know how much you loved your father, Bruce. I know that debate was hard on you, too. Harvey, don't. You should talk about it. Finding out your dad drugged Esther Cobblepot? Hill admitting to having both of them killed? It's a lot to process. I'm sorry. Just because I keep reliving it doesn't mean you want to. Well, I'm not even convinced that tape was real. It had to be fake. Doctored to look like something else. I hope you're right. Might as well take a lot to prove that to the public. <sighs> look, I, uh... I realize what a terrible friend I've been to you. I was so focused on the campaign. I, I thought distancing myself from you was the only option. I'm sorry. Okay, Kane wrote something. Give me a second. Stoned. Uh, King got a picture from uh, what's it called? Evac in stage two. If you want to see it. Okay, let's let's continue. Game. Oh. It's a bit late for apologies, isn't it, Harvey? Yeah. I guess it is. What is that? Batman symbol. Coming from near the GCPD. <laughs> That's one way to get the guy's attention. And look, I, I should get going, Harv. What? Already? What else do you have to do? My, my assistant won't be here for another hour. You can, you, you can stay the TV. if you want. I have a call to make. I, I'm sorry, Harvey. I can't wait. You know, I think rich people are always on the phone. <laughs> it's a curse. Well, go on then. Wouldn't want you to keep them waiting. You keep your head up, Harvey. Thanks, Bruce. Unit 6 in pursuit of suspects westbound on 15th Street. Is it the children of Arkham? Can you confirm? Negative. They're taking date shots man. at us whenever we get close. Not that man. Understood. Stay on them. I'll we'll be your date man, something. Lisa. A little help would be nice. Hang in there, all right? Oh, they knew we'd be there, Jim. We don't have enough officers to deal with this. Look, everyone stretched thin. I'm doing what I can. I have to go. That light has a bat on it, Jim. You give me a number to call, I'll rethink my methods. I'm just glad I got your attention. I didn't have a lot of options. So, here we are. Yeah, well, it worked. I'm here. I appreciate it. Things are a mess. I'd rather have you arrested than come to you for help. But the truth is, we're desperate. I'm calling a truce, just for tonight. Bring me up to speed. Right. 
Rene Montoya, one of my officers. The one who tried to shoot me? I know, but hear me out. She's trying to clear her name after those animals manipulated her into killing Falcone. Well, She's supposed to be on leave, but she got a tip on the children of Arkham's chemical stash, went rogue. It's, She's uh, out there alone, and I can't spare anyone to back her up. I told her to wait, but this is personal. It's the children of Arkham pumped her full of that Shut junk. up, Gordon. I'll find her. We'll take down the children of Arkham together. That's what I like to hear. These children of Arkham are everywhere all of a sudden. Where the hell they all come from? I, mean, I never heard of them before. And that debate. Oh, they're tearing up the entire city. Never mind how this began. We have to focus on it's the same with the bad computer. I if could change you've got the color, any bright ideas, or I change the color. I'm all ears. Into pink. Gordon, blue. this is Schultz. Over. Gordon here. We got a problem with the mayor, sir. What happened? Is he okay? I don't know. We <laughs> lost him. He took off and left us behind. Christ, one more crisis sure? I can't deal with right now. We've got to keep both Montoya and Dent safe. Somehow. I'm on it. You there? Always. Launch the drones. I need eyes on the city. Lucius has made some upgrades. I'll let him explain. Who are you talking to? You got a whole team or something? My butler? Yeah. My butler. <laughs> yeah, hilarious. All right, patching you through to R&D in Wayne Enterprises. Batman, so listen. The first model was only equipped for visual surveillance, but seeing how you used them at the skyline, I thought you'd need an audio feed as well. The microphones are incredibly sensitive. I'm sensitive they can pick too. up sounds from up to 500 yards. In some cases, you'll even be able to hear through walls, like X-ray peering. Nice work. Thanks. I'll talk to you soon. There it is. Any the idea where they pink. might be? Montoya's car was, was spotted me. crossing the bridge to Arkham Island. Could be where the handoff is happening. What about Dent? We're probably headed to his acceptance speech. They just left the hospital and we lost sight of him. Hmm. What do you keep looking at? That car's been behind us since the hospital. Oh God, is this guy trying to drive us off the road? Just drive faster. What the? Oh, damn it! Barrels of this stuff to transfer. And not a big window to unload all of that. They said they wanted it done tonight. So, it's gotta be done. You wanna argue with them? Be my guest. You just keep an eye out for that cop. Nobody move! This is the police! Get her! Okay. Go to Montoya. Headed to the construction site. Send whatever men you can spare after Dent. I'll round up what officers I can. Gonna have to head out there myself, too. I know this is risky, Batman. Just be careful. Unit 6, requesting backup. Corner of 15th and Main. We got a major disturbance here. Several armed suspects on the loose. You don't... You, he's not there to kiss you. Yes, but it, it went crappy. From episode to episode. Have you seen pink? I chose the pink. Oh. Oh, I might have failed pressing the buttons. Try again. They can see the nice pink again. One. 
Batman, look out! It's over. Drop the gun. Look, I promise I'm not gonna shoot you, okay? I used to think you were a threat, but I was wrong. We both have much bigger problems right now. I'm sorry. Can you forgive me? Those guys had me pinned down. If you hadn't shown up when you did, I... You want forgiveness? Look somewhere else. I just want you to know... I've got your back, all right? I don't know what I was thinking, coming out here alone. I nearly blew it. I could be dead. Or you could be dead. And it'd be on me. I don't take that lightly, you know. I still don't understand how they knew I was coming. Heads up. The cops just sent three black and whites to stop our guys going after Dent. In the chatter, sounds like Gordon's with them. Someone's gotta help Gordon. They know he's coming. Go. I'll see what I can find here. I'm not giving up on this. Alfred. Are you alright? Yeah. But they knew I was coming. They seem to be getting info on the GCPD's whereabouts. Not sure how. Nice leg. I need an update on Harvey. Bringing it up now. Deborah, get down! <gasps> Mr. Dent, what did you do to him? I said get back in the car! There's more of them coming! Put down your weapon! There's too many of them! Everybody take cover! You'd better get down there! Shut on my be... way. You heard you better get down there. Yummy. Why is the sound missing again? This is like, I don't know. Of course they voted against it. Self-defense, he says. New mayor's pretty tough, turns out. Killed one of those guys attacking him with his bare hands. Dent did that? Guess the fella's lucky Dent got to him before you did, huh? You're right. I wouldn't have let him off that easy. Of course you pocket, what's up? We got our asses handed to us. They knew you were coming. How? We've been using a secure channel. You saying we got a leak? Gordon, Gordon to, to command. command. Anyone, Anyone there? there? Command here. What is it, Gordon? Turn that off. What? It's been compromised. The children of Arkham are listening in on the GCPD's communications. I'm gonna look into this. I'll let you know what I find. Sounds like me on a toilet. Bruce? The GCPD's been compromised. The children of Arkham were listening the whole time. How? That's what I'm going to find out. Alfred, I'm sending over evidence of some kind of encrypted communication signal. It's coming up on my screen now, but I'm afraid it looks like a bunch of gibberish to me. I need to go to Wayne Tower and look into this. Get me Lucius on the line. Yes, right away. If the public finds out the police aren't able to communicate... It's I'm not shit. sure of anything right now, Good job. but Lucius will have answers. 
I have a feeling we've only seen the tip of the iceberg. Hopefully it doesn't sink us, sir. I have Lucius on the line now. Bruce, are you there? I'm looking at this data Alfred sent me. It's messy. I have to know what the children of Arkham are doing. How fast can you decrypt? Hi, game. Are you lagging like shit? That's a tough one. But I should have it cracked soon if you can meet me at Wayne Tower. This is the name of a video game where you play a little devil. Already on my way. Why the fuck is the game lagging like shit? I need you. Doesn't make any sense. This is annoying. Just PC things? I don't think so. This is the Almost problem there, when you Lucius. only have one truck. I'll meet you down in the lab. Some aspects of the children of Arkham surveillance are worrying. Great. The cage was nice, right? Bruce. Chairwoman. I didn't think you'd be here. No? I was, uh... You just don't know how to handle niggas. <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> Dude, Luke Cage is amazing. Every time he said, like, somebody said nigga, he got some, some punch in the face. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I, I had to do it. <laughs> yeah, but, but Daredevil and then Luke Cage and then I think uh, Jessica Jones in that order. I didn't say Nazi. I used to look to Thomas for guidance in hard times. Must seem silly, after everything that's happened. You know what they say about old habits. To what do I owe the pleasure, Regina? I'm sorry, I just needed to clear my head, sort things out. In my office? I know it's irregular, but it's nice to have a reminder of the Waynes every once in a while, in all their glory. I've been called in for an emergency board meeting. I wasn't told about it. You weren't invited, Bruce. You are the topic of discussion for the board. They want to decide what your future at this company will be. Whether to dismiss you or not. Well, it, it depends. It was, it was way hard on the comic, but the TV show was very close to the comics, which was nice. And I really like when somebody said nigga to Luke, that, that Luke just... Doesn't matter if it was a black guy that said nigga to him, but it was amazing that he just, uh, just punched him in the face or just, just said, I'm not a nigga. It's the same with uh, Mafia 3 when, uh, what was his name? Crap, I forgot the name of the, of the character. When you, when you said it to him, he was like, I'm, I'm not a nigger. You have to understand, Bruce. This company is bigger than any one individual. We have to keep face. <laughs> and after this scandal... What? I don't love they it, but some, sometimes it slips. It's possible they can. It's the most logical solution with the business in jeopardy. Why 1718? I don't get it. I have to agree with it, though. Are you counting Bruce, your words? You need to get down here. Now. I worked with your parents for years, and neither of them gave any indication of foul play. How could you have ever known? Bruce. You're nothing like him, Bruce. We always build up the people closest to us. When they fall, it's a terrible blow to everyone around them. Regina, really, I need you to leave. I was just trying to I help. know, but please just go. Fine. The board is waiting for me anyway. Don't forget who your allies are, Mr. Wayne. I'll come find you after. I bet it's with a clock, something. I'll be right down, Lucius. Oh, maybe not. Checkmate? Really? Oh, just one? Okay, I don't need to play chess. No, Lucius is the black guy. Why did he count pocket, by the way?
Why do you say inward? It's good to hear she's still in your corner. <laughs> Spying on my conversations Hi, again. Me. Hey, I'm looking out for you. This is There've Lucius. been whispers that the board was going to take action against you. If you lose the company, Batman will take a massive hit too. I know the cave is well equipped, but all of this is owned and paid for by the company. I don't need to worry about the board. I've got plenty of money. We'll make do. Yeah, plenty now, but still not enough for all of this. What is BBC Big Black Cock? Right now, okay. finding out how the children of Arkham are spying on the police <laughs> okay. is more important. What have you got? It's Wayne Tech, Bruce. As you know, Wayne Enterprises is a telecommunications giant. If someone were to, say, uh, build a back door into that tech... You're telling me the children of Arkham hacked into the system? So that's the thing. Do you want the good news or the bad news? Uh, you're not gonna like it. Just get on with it, Lucius. We don't have time for games. Forgive me for trying to lighten the mood. The back door they're using. I was the one who built it. You? What are you talking about? When your mission as Batman started, you needed a way to monitor the city. Well, this is how. I piggyback Batman's surveillance onto Wayne Enterprise's signal. If the children of Arkham have access to the same system, does that mean they know my identity? It looks like they've only accessed the GCPD so far. Not a lot of activity otherwise. I'll have Alfred warn Gordon. The GCPD needs to get rid of their Wayne Tech devices. Smart move. <laughs> I've encrypted our access. I can fortify it, but it's gonna take longer to force them out of the system. The question remains, how did the children of Arkham find out about the back door in the first place? They shouldn't have been able to find it. Not unless they knew what they were looking for. Whoever broke in certainly knew how to cover their tracks. We have a mole. There's no way they could have gained access without someone on the inside. Nerd. Only a handful of people at the highest level could possibly find out about the back door. I'm gonna keep working on this Children of Arkham business. See if there's a way to shut down their access entirely. We'd better lock this stuff down, just in case. What the fuck?! Newly elected Mayor Harvey Dent gave a rousing speech late last night, refuting claims that the children of Arkham were gaining control in Gotham. Despite his run-in with the masked group on the way to the event, people are still hopeful that Mayor Dent can pull through on his campaign promises. People like the children of Arkham want to tear us apart. They want to burn everything that we've built to the ground. They don't choose to see the good in this city. But I do. Batman does. And we will fight to protect that goodness. Because we are not the children of Arkham's playthings. We are proud citizens of Gotham. And this is our city. Next up, we speak to Commissioner Grogan regarding increased security measures city... Uh, Tiffany's really taking after you. And Luke... Stubborn as always. I think of what Gotham has become, and I think of them. They give me all the reason I need to work with Batman. He's the only one that will truly protect what? them. What? Well, I don't see him. And he will, Lucius. Always. He shouldn't watch because he doesn't like Looks to. like another invaluable piece of Lucius Fox technology. Gotta finish since when? Ooh, what's this? Uh, something I'm still working on. Some new armament to assist you in the field. There's only so much you can do on your own. But it's not really ready yet. Thermal vision? <laughs> You've been busy, haven't you, Lucius? It's a grapple. 
Yeah, man, you're not hot. This is hot. Not sure I'll ever get the first one back from Selena. <laughs> Wonder if that's the only thing she stole. Dreilochstute. What the fuck? You did? Who is it? A new sticky bomb I developed. The signal is activated on the underside. Attach it wherever you need, then detonate it remotely with your gauntlet. Boom. Nice. Be careful. Those things pack a serious punch. Yeah, put it in your... okay. So, anything new? This is gonna take some time. Don't worry. I'll let you know when I find something. I can't want to leave now, I checked everything. Right, table. I always wonder why you had a table that could hide itself. Guess it's coming in pretty handy now. Trust me, it was much more paranoia than precaution. Looks like Regina's headed to my office. I should go. And before you do... Here. Get that back to the Bat computer. It'll install the added security measures. You'll also have all the info I found on the Children of Arkham's activity within the system. I never played Mass Thanks, Effect. Thanks, Lucius. I've always got your back, Batman. Now get out of here. Regina doesn't like to be kept waiting. Hi, Lucius. Maybe you left. Yeah, right. Well, the board has voted. And have they sent the chairwoman to wield the axe? You're being asked to step down from your position as CEO. Effective immediately. At least until this whole mess gets cleaned up. We were out of options, I'm afraid. Nope. I won't do it. Bruce. This is my company. My name. And that name is exactly why we're in this situation. This isn't a request, Bruce. I asked to slow all this down, but... The press release is going out as we speak. There will be a public event in the morning where you will formally announce your resignation. I'm sorry, Bruce. I tried to fight for you. Of course you the did. The board believes this is the only logical course of action. I see where they're coming from. I really appreciate you trying, Regina. Thanks. Don't mention it. Our stock is tanking. The board is losing confidence. Wayne Enterprises needs a new face. They already had a candidate in mind. I thought it was... <clears throat> I was Old outvoted. Black dude is Lucius. Remember, he'd only be interim CEO. Just until this mess gets cleared up. And who would that be? Cobblepot? Oswald Fuck you. Cobblepot. Fuck you! Bruce, old boy. Good to see you again. Fuck you! As you know, Oswald's parents were, well, victims of your father's actions. This company was built on the land he stole from the Cobblepot family. Well, the board thought having me step in would be a good PR move. What better way to show Gotham that Wayne Enterprises is committed to righting the wrongs of the past? Happy to help any way I can. Shut up! People aren't much behind the Wayne name now. 
And considering that your parents stole from mine, Cobblepot sits easier on the tongue. I don't need your help. I can fix this myself. Well, that's admirable, but your name is tarnished, Bruce. You need me. Unfortunately, he's right. Any move from you, no matter how genuine, would appear self-serving at this point. The board has complete confidence in Mr. Cobblepot. As his resume goes into great detail, his endeavors in England have been quite successful. Besides, the company basically runs itself at this point. The CEO is mostly a figurehead. What Don't if... make this harder than it has to be. A oh, fuck. You might want to check your facts, Regina. That resume sounds a little too good to be true. You might want to have more confidence in your own board. His resume checks out, and his references were all glowing. You're quite welcome to call them yourself. That won't be necessary. I'm afraid we need you to leave the building immediately. We'll have your personal effects sent to you. Those whores and bitches. And sons of bitches. Congratulations, Bruce. I couldn't be prouder of you. Alfred. Oh, how sweet. Graduation present. Surely we could let him take this along. Son oh, of a bitch, Bruce. I'm gonna kill you. Clumsy, clumsy. No wonder you're not being trusted with nice things anymore. I'll call someone in to clean that up. It'll only take a minute. Oh, Bruce and I can handle it. No trouble. Right, Bruce. <laughs> Bruce! I need security in here right now. No, oh, what was that This is for? a disaster. You've lost your bloody mind. Bruce, stop this. Oh, for heaven's sake, calm down. What's gotten into you? In your face. Oh, Get him out of my office. Let's go. I'm so sorry, Mr. Copperpot. I'll go fetch the medic. That's very kind of you, Regina. Thank you. Bruce! They're out of their minds. They can't do this to you. This isn't over yet, Lucius. Uh, he sounds, uh, like, uh... Shit, Lee from The Walking Dead, Season 1. The entrance. I took care of it. We can't let anyone find out what's down there, Bruce. There are ways they could get in. You know that. Just stay out of it. Don't go near it, and they won't be able to connect it to you. It's not that easy. Lucius, I need to know there's someone I can trust on the inside. I'm here for you, Bruce. I've always been here for you, not them. If I stay, I'll have to stop working on our side project. I knew it! That means no new tech, that no repairs. Know something. I could keep an eye on things for you. Let you know what they're up to. Feed you what information I can. But I can't risk Cobblepot finding out what I'm up to. Come work for me. It won't be what you have here, but at least we can keep pace on the new bad tech. I'll go and gather what I can from the lab. Thanks, Lucius. Keep that drive safe. You heard it, drive safe. Bruce Wayne will speak on the issue at a press event tomorrow morning, where we'll learn more about his decision to step down. More on that in a moment. I still can't believe it. Which part? I wish life were easier for you, Bruce. It's just one thing after another. Oh. That's why I'm glad I have you, Al. Mm -hmm. Always. Mm -hmm. With the children of Arkham accessing Wayne Tech, I have to figure out what their next move is. Bring up a searchable network of all possible electronic traffic related to Wayne Enterprises. If the children of Arkham are in our system, all of this is potentially accessible. All of this? 
Lucius was very thorough. It means that they could have eyes and ears into almost everything in Gotham. Just like Batman. They had access to the GCBD, we know that. The real question is, what else they'd be interested in? Filter for possible targets based on known children of Arkham activity. Hmm. Patients committed to Arkham going back 20 years. A rather extensive list. With my father's signature as the transferring doctor. Security footage. These date back decades. Alfred, the video at the debate. It's real. This is how they found their evidence. Something Hill did gave them access. At least now I know the truth. No, I... Yes. Yes, I know it takes time, but... statement of the century. Considering I've got at least one of my guys in the ER. Yes. Just please let me know when it happens. The children of Arkham aren't going to wait on us. I suppose I can understand the truth of that. Harvey has no idea. It's impossible to tell if the children of Arkham have access to this, but if they do, any action he takes against them, they'll see coming. Are you done here, sir? Give me a minute, I want to check this. Not yet. Gotham Courthouse. All public records pass through this place. Now look at this. Oswald's public record. None of this is right. His whole criminal history doesn't exist as far as the rest of the world is concerned. This must be what the board saw. Not a blemish in sight. What does it mean, man? I wonder if they've cleared out all the Wayne hey, man. This is ridiculous, Gordon. Do you know how much all this equipment costs? We don't have the budget to replace it all. It's a risk we've got to take, Commissioner. If I the children paid of Arkham can ago. hack into our systems, we're completely in And to be honest, I don't care. I really don't care. Jeff, do you think going into situations completely blind is any better? Considering the alternative, yes. Sounds like they've got the situation under control. Good. One less problem to deal with. Actually, it's three hours ago. I've seen enough. I have to go warn Harvey. Like my head? I don't see the head. Keep an eye on this, Alfred, and have Lucius look into it as well. We need to find a way to lock them out. Very good, sir. Welcome back, Mr. Wayne. You can go on in. I'm back. You yes, have been that's right. Away. The back time. I'll need a rental in the meantime. Yeah, yeah, just get it done. What? No, 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 no press conference. Just tell them to reschedule. Okay, yeah, we'll, we'll talk later. I mean, I don't see Don Cherry either. Uh, it's no mainly your head, and then you like my head? Uh, hey, Harv. Jesus! Don't sneak up on people like that. I wasn't expecting you, Bruce. You scared me right out of my skin. Whoa, whoa, what is your problem? You're being a bit erratic. Yeah, I'm sorry, Bruce. I'm just a little shaky. My nerves are totally shot. Uh, did anyone follow you? D no, what? Uh, good, no, that's, that's good. You can never be too careful. My mayoral portrait is scheduled for this morning. <laughs> Guess I don't really feel the part right now. I've been looking forward to this my entire career. Thought I'd win in a landslide. I'd be loved and supported, but this... I don't know, it just all feels different. I feel hated. Like the city's against me. It's like I don't fit. It's like I don't deserve it. After all, is it really a win if it's by default? Trust me, Harv. You were born to do this. You're the only person that can make a difference here. 
part of me thinks you're just lying to make me feel better. Mm, to get into your God, the mess that Hill left behind. I'm telling you, it's gonna take months to get everything back on track. I can't get the phone to stop ringing. The city's been in an uproar since the- Hold on, Harvey. You're acting weird, Bruce. Is something wrong? Just tell me! Are we being watched? What is going on? The technology at Wayne Enterprise is compromised. The children of Arkham are using our tech to listen in on Gotham. I knew it. They're already keeping tabs on the GCPD, and I'm pretty sure you're on their list, too. Bastards! They're like cockroaches. I've had this feeling for a while, that I'm never alone anymore, that I'm always being watched. The children of Arkham, they, they attacked my car. They are after me, Bruce. They want me dead. They tried at the debate, and they will try again. How am I expected to leave when I've got a target on my back? I'm telling you, it's like they're always there, in the back of my mind. I feel like I am trapped in a nightmare and I can't get out. Everywhere I go, I am terrified. I'll turn a corner and come face to face with the children of Arkham. They don't run this city, Harvey. You do. You have the highest authority in Gotham. You have all the power, not them. I'm not so sure, Bruce. I'm telling you, they've grown too powerful too fast. I don't know if I can do it on my own. You know what I should do? The GCPD is all but useless against these children of Arkham. Batman knows how this city works. He knows you can't be gentle with criminals. You've got to strike fear into their hearts, and maybe break a few bones along the way. But something's holding him back. I mean, just think. Imagine what he could do if we let him off the leash. He won't have the GCPD breathing down his neck anymore. He'll be able to really make the children of Arkham pay. I'm not sure if you paid attention, but yeah, I have to listen to, to a lot of stuff. Wants. I know he's a vigilante, but Batman's always respected a lot. I don't think he'll change his ways anytime soon. Nah, then he's limiting himself. That man works outside of the law. He's the only one getting anything done in this city. I mean, imagine, just imagine if we had an army of vigilantes just like him. It'll be a new Gotham. A better Gotham. We can use the children of Arkham's methods against them. If they want to play dirty, we'll play dirty. And they won't see it coming. Harvey, look, you've been under a lot of stress, especially with all the trauma recently. Maybe, maybe you should- Don't tell Harvey what to do, Wayne. Don't you dare. Hmm. And mentally into Two-Face. Nice. Oh, God. Bruce, I'm so sorry. I, uh... I guess I just lost myself a little bit there. Uh, Mr. Dent? The photographer's ready for you. Thank you, Deborah. I'll talk be about right myself out. In the third person as well. Please, Bruce. Don't tell anyone about this. I was just, you know, thinking out loud. That's all. Mm -hmm. I didn't mean any of it. It's just the, the stress of the job kind of gets to me. Look, Harvey, that therapist you told me about. I think you should call her. Maybe she can help you work through whatever this is that you're going through. Just think about it, okay? Uh, yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll look into it. <sighs> See you around, Bruce. Bye, Two Face. An interview with the children of Arkham's leader. I wonder how Vicky managed to score that. Bruce? Uh, have you seen today's copy of the Gazette? It just arrived a moment ago. It seems Miss Vale has been talking to some very interesting people. People the Batman would like to find. Do you think she would be willing to help you? She may be the only lead we have on the children of Arkham's leader. Perhaps hmm. she could be persuaded to reveal her source. Last time we talked, I gave her a pretty valuable tip. Sergeant Montoya's name. Though after this interview, I'm sure the police will become suspicious of all of Miss Vale's sources. And if they find out you leaked Montoya's name... True. We need to be careful. I can't afford to waste time with Vicky. Let's offer her a chat with Batman. Good idea, sir. Can you scramble the line? Right away. Vale. 
I saw your story in the Gazette this morning. I want to talk. Who... who is this? Hello? You... you don't have to say anything. I... I've got a pretty good guess. Batman, right? I've been meaning to thank you. What you did at the debate. I'm not sure I would have made it out of there otherwise. I'd say I owe you one. Meet me at sundown. Cobblepot Park. Deal. Looks like I'm close to the end. Oh nice, it's statue again. Strange place to meet. Wasn't sure you were gonna show. Gotta admit, part of me thought it was a prank call. Nothing is ever this easy, especially not when you're a reporter. I need some information from you. It's important. <laughs> yeah, figured as much. So, <laughs> Batman, I'll skip the obvious question. The children of Arkham seem to be your latest target. We all know their methods are extreme, but what about their message? Their leader claims that Gotham's elite have been abusing their power, often at the expense of ordinary citizens. For the record, do you think there's any validity to what they're saying? In your opinion. <sighs> Fine. Will you talk now? Their message is picking up traction. Especially since the interview. I need to know everything they told you. Does no one read anymore? It was a lot of posturing and grandiose monologuing, really. We're going to purge the city of corruption sort of thing. Not great from an investigative standpoint, but the public will eat it up. Part of the job, you know? If that's the only reason you called me, you should really just read it yourself. They aren't trying to hide their motivations. Gotham needs to know how dangerous the children of Arkham really are. You are hiding the truth. No, huh. not. My editor says the physical copies are practically sold out. I'd say the truth is getting out there. It just may not be the side you like. But that's why I'm here. To get the other half I'm missing. Where did you meet? How did they contact you? Yeah, okay, I'm gonna stop you right there. I'm not selling out a source. Not even for Batman. The circumstances of that meeting are confidential. Just like this one. I'm sure you wouldn't want me telling everyone how to get a hold of you. I can't give you specifics. And if you want my honest opinion, you're wasting your time with the children of Arkham. You should be looking at Bruce Wayne. And before she said I still want to believe he's a good guy too, but with the information that surfaced, everyone's angry. Everyone wants him to answer for what his family did. Everyone, except for you. Why haven't you gone after him yet? No way, he just slipped under your radar. But so far, no action from you against him. No investigation. Bruce Wayne is innocent. He's not responsible for what his father did. Maybe not, but he still benefits from it. All those people suffered so that he could prosper up in that mansion of his. I don't know if you have some connection with him. Maybe there's more to this story than I realize. But you can't ignore the facts. Whether he intended to or not, his family has been stealing from innocent people for years. So, what are you gonna do about it? What I'll is Batman you. doing to protect them from Bruce Wayne? The people wanna know. Believe me, I'll make sure Bruce Wayne's debt is repaid. Gotham will be glad to hear it. Thank you. Good luck with the children of Arkham. Thank you, lady. I'll be sure your message gets out. <gasps> I can make you talk. You're, you're really going to threaten me. If you think I'm upholding our deal now... God, I could lose my job for this, but... Here. This is where we met for the interview. Please, don't tell anyone I gave this to you.
she's still gonna die. I think her pants are wet as well. I trained people. Everything's dark, quiet, it's empty. No sign of the children of Arkham? They may not have gone far. They should be there. No security, no emergency staff. If Vicky's right, it shouldn't be this quiet. Be on your guard. I'll continue monitoring the drone feeds from here. Thanks. Go and have a look around. There's a body here. Likely the work of the children of Arkham. I'm gonna look around, see what they've been up to. Okay, I still have no clue who the fucking leader is. Maybe, maybe she's one of them. Maybe she's actually the leader. But I think she was at the press conference. Someone's been practicing chemistry. Chemistry. This solvent increases dermal permeability. Looks like they ran out of the absorbing agent. Something spilled here. This mess come. What the fuck? This is the drug they've been using. Refined. It's the same as the one given to Montoya and Harvey. So Harvey's gonna become fucking Two-Face because of that stuff? These barrels match the shrapnel that I found at the docks. They've been referencing the map. Whatever they're building must hinge on it somehow. This depot is pretty centrally located. A detonation device, but it's disabled. They must have intended to hook it up to something. The timer is set for 27 minutes and 13 seconds. From now? The numbers aren't moving. Doesn't seem to be counting down yet. This is how they were timing their route. Alfred, what stations are within a 27-minute train ride from this depot? Looking into the transportation database now. Sir, there's just one. Mercy Street Station. It's one of the busiest places in the city. Mercy Street Thousands of people Street go Station. in and out every hour. He's been dead for a while from the looks of it. One of the children of Arkham. Loyalty doesn't get you much with these people, does it? Seems strange. There's something else. He was shot dead center. Twice. Executed. It outlived his usefulness, I suppose. This man's veins. They look like Montoya's veins after she was drugged, only... There's so much worse. The same drug from the debate. I feared we hadn't seen the last of it. There's no puncture mark here. No entry point for an injection. So, how did it get in his body? Ian. Okay, we got this train station. Did I miss something? This train car has been modified. How do you mean? Clearly the holding tank. It's empty, for now. Erox is calling. Ooh. Easy access. The train car was raised to make working beneath it easier. They wanted to get this done fast. Looks like some kind of sprinkler system. Doubtful they're planning to put out fires. The train car is their delivery system. Maximum coverage. Okay, some more. I think I got everything, so let's link this one to the to the barrels. <sighs> this wouldn't work. I need to know where their target is. Doesn't work, are you kidding me? So it's 
It's a map then, right? A modified train car is going to be sent to Mercy Street Station. They have from me. Which one? SDFU? This is probably... No clue. Shit, what did I try to link? This, this stuff? Didn't pay attention. Shouldn't work. Looks like they ran out of the chemical they were mixing it with. It worked. What are they planning to do with this? He works as the Norwegian guy. What exactly are they planning to release? Wait, did I miss something? This is linked. If it is linked, I'm missing something. Oh, I'm linking wrong. Yeah, he watches me and touches himself most of the time, like Mare does. Confirm no injection. Game, I would like to. Wait, this is the only one that's alive. Are you kidding me? Looks like they ran out of the chemical they were mixing it with. What are they planning to do with this? I'm feeling I'm missing something. I can't even cancel this shit. Ah, the clock, right? This stuff here? Wait. Just this? Yeah. Did I miss the clock here? Okay, hey, break link again. I can't break this shit. Okay, so this seems to be wrong. The drug is being modified here. They're changing it. Okay, this seems right now. They've altered the drug so that it can be absorbed through the skin. The drug. The children of Arkham must have found a way to weaponize it. With a drug that can absorb into skin, it will affect hundreds of people at once. They're loading the modified drug into the tanks on the train cars, dispersing it through the sprinklers. The timers are set to go off just as it rolls in over the crowds. We are prepared to contain something of that scale. Releasing a drug like that in so populated an area would be devastating. They could infect the entire city if they had enough. Good thing you reduced their supply at the construction site. Yeah, Thankfully, you there wasn't enough of the chemical to mix with the rest of the stockpile of drugs. You up for dicks? There's a train coming! Take cover! Oh, that's a lead up. Oh, no, okay, that's a guy. Who is it? 
If I'd known you were gonna make me lug this thing myself, I would have worn more comfortable shoes. What the fuck? Just add it to the list of your mistakes. Must be why you didn't come through on your last assignment. Fucking bitch. Hmm. Yeah, what, what? That's true. What, what in the butt? We're down to our last few barrels since Batman screwed up the transfer. We'll <sighs> have to make do, I guess. Okay, you two, get these mixed loaded onto the train. This way. Their leader is here, with Catwoman. Catwoman? She's got more of that absorbing agent. She must have a good reason for being there. She plays whatever side meets her needs. Currently, her needs seem to be focused on keeping all nine of her lives. We're done here, right? Not yet. No, 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 no. There's no part two of this. I got what you wanted. I'm done. You might as well come out, Batman. I know you're here. Wait, what? No way. I did not bring him here. I honored our deal. Oh, I know you did. But now, you're a loose end. Surrender. Unless you'd like to see firsthand what a critical dose looks like. She joined poor Esther Cobblepot. <laughs> Death might be preferable. Put this aside. Now oh, screw this. Nice legs. Woo! Train's ready. Come on. Who the fuck is this? <laughs> you have to face the truth sometime, Batman. You can't protect Gotham from itself. They lit the fire. We're just here to stoke the flames. Saddest thing is, they don't even see the smoke. <laughs> Just let me Let me force Robin. Like in uh, Arkham Knight. Oh, nice blood. <laughs> I think that she stole me in the first episode.
come on, unmask that fucker. I wanna know who it is. Now they're gonna make out. Hang in there. Don't pass out on me. Come on, bats. Back. <laughs> Should have gone after. Uh, shut up. <sighs> I'm gonna get you somewhere safe. In here, Just stay with me. It's probably over now. What? Why are you kicking down your own door? Come on. Such a baby. Uh, uh, uh. Stay here, okay? Just don't move. Need for a harvest dropping by. I need to get back out there. I'm fine. I just need to get back out. That might work on your butler, but I'm not buying that crap. Stay there. Nice ass lady. <sighs> Shit. You're lucky you were wearing that suit. You know that was stupid, right? <sighs> What? Showing up at that train depot. Taking on their leader alone. Repeat after me, Bruce. I am not invincible, and painkillers do not solve the problem. You weren't gonna take them down on your own. They would have killed you. <laughs> You're one to talk. <laughs> I never pick a fight I can't win. I don't think you're getting very far with a shoulder like this. Oh, great. You can stay here until morning. Not that I owe you anything. After the debate, I'd say we're even. Selena. It's fine. You can have the couch until morning. Then I'm done owing you favors. Probably best to lie low for now anyway. I don't want the children of Arkham finding this place. I had it handled, you know. With their leader? I had a plan. Really didn't need you swooping in and messing it up. I wasn't there to save you. I thought you'd gone back over to their side. You thought you were gonna take me out, did you? Mm -hmm. Hell if I had to. Out for dinner. Good luck. That was gonna be my ticket out of here. One last job to get the goons off my back. So much for that. Thanks again, Bats. I'm sorry I messed things up for you back there. I know. I'm used to it anyway. There's no such thing as a fresh start. Well, look who's back. Hey, little one. I don't think she likes you. <laughs> okay, she really doesn't like you. Yeah, well, you've got most of Gotham behind you on that. Well, not most. Maybe half. Just trying to be optimistic. <laughs> Cut it out. This really hasn't been your week, has it? <laughs> you think? I lost my company, my reputation, and I find out my father was... Just like everyone else. They've all got something to hide, Bruce. Every last one of them. Even the so-called good guys. There's always something. So what is it you're hiding, Selena? All kinds of things. Thank Come you. on, Bruce. Even you have your secrets. Those things you hide from the world. And won't let anyone else see? Are you saying you don't trust me? I'm saying... I probably shouldn't. You're a good man, Bruce. 
But good men don't lie with thieves. I know what I am. No noble intentions. Just the thrill of breaking what they say can't be broken. Knowing there's no safe I can't crack. No fortress I can't infiltrate. Proving I can. I'm never really sure if I can trust you. Can't say I blame you for that. I've stolen from corrupt jerks like Hill, but I've taken plenty from good people, too. For what? Some shiny new toys in a crappy apartment on the edge of town? A high is nice, but it wears off. Then you look around and see... Nothing. Nothing. So you get back out there. Try and chase that feeling down. But it never amounts to anything, really. You're not alone, okay? I'm here for you. Thanks, Bats. Uh-oh. Hmm. I think you may have misinterpreted things. Oh. Sorry. I bet if we play this on Sunday and everyone is, uh, is voting for Kiss the Forehead, she's gonna react like this. Hey, I think it's... I thought... Never mind. Harvey's my friend. I... I can't do this to him. There's nothing going on with me and Harvey. Maybe not for you. you could Let me go get Sunday. you a blanket. I'm the gentleman here. At least she's not hissing at you anymore. Hooray for small miracles. Another drink? Uh, no. No, I'm fine. Thanks. What's the Never nice run part? into anyone else who did this, you know? Well, in a, in a bad girl. You can't be Batman uh, all the time. In a Catwoman outfit So what's nice. a night off look like? What do you do when you take off the mask? You kidding? I love being Batman. I feel more at home in the suit what? than I do as Bruce Wayne. You ever feel that way? I guess I just never saw them as different to begin with. No. Me and Catwoman. It's the same thing. You're gonna vote on Sunday for all the sex, and then she's gonna I gonna back out in the last good night, second. Then. Good night, Selena. It's Alfred. Well, how he says said Albert. There's something else that I could use. Yeah, it wouldn't be the first time she kicks my ass. It is nothing around. Oh, here, yeah, what's? I think it's safe to assume she didn't pay for that. Why should she? It's in a Chinese takeout box. Bruce? Morning, Alfred. Oh, thank goodness. I was worried. I hadn't heard from you. I didn't know what happened if... if you were... I, uh, took a bit of a beating when I ran to the children of Arkham. What happened? It's kind of a long story. I'll tell you about it when I get back. <sighs> I always fear the day you don't come home, Bruce. I know, Al. Where are you, anyway? I, uh, I stayed at Selena's last night. Oh. <laughs> Nothing happened. <laughs> I never said it did. While you're there, this might be a good opportunity to learn more about Miss Kyle. After all, we really don't know anything about her. See what you can find lying around. If she's trustworthy, you may not have another chance. Yeah, um, 
It's a smart idea. I'll see what I can find. At the very least, you can find that grapple gun of yours. Right. That might be harder than you'd think. She doesn't share your love of organization. Yes, well, I'll see you back at home, Bruce. Scarlet Pimpernel, much ado about nothing. Petrarca. Hm. Didn't take her for a romantic. What's this one? Oh, the Gita Govinda. That's academic. Her cat eats like a queen while she's eating junk. How does he know uh, that she's eating junk without checking the fridge? Good Haven, mm. isn't it? Vacation spots or just marks on her burglary From checklist? Nightwing? I think that's Nightwing City. This looks better than mine. Wow! It looks alright to me. Nothing growing, at least. At least she's got the essentials. It's Harvey. Harvey. Hey, I, uh, I brought breakfast. C can I come in? I don't know if that's such a good idea. Just for a minute. I really need to talk to you. <laughs> if you want me to go... Oh, I'll go. But I have to get this out. Fuck the kid! Bruce? What the... Seriously? What are you doing here? Have a seat, Harvey. No! I don't need to sit down. Bruce, tell me what is going on. I spent the night here. That's it. You... You... I can't believe this! Don't! Don't touch me! I thought I would come here and... So stupid! God, I should have known. I should have known that you would do this to me. You were just using me, weren't you? Both of you! Harvey, nothing happened, I promise you. No, you don't have to answer to him. He... He will not be able to protect you. And I don't need him to. Just... Get out of here, Harvey. What happens when the children of Arkham come for him? You think you won't get caught in the crossfire? They're coming for all of us. He can't stop them. I can handle the children of Arkham. <laughs> of course. Two faces is taking over. Bruce Wayne can do anything. Everything Harvey couldn't. He thinks he's so much better. I'm sorry. What the hell is going on with you? Up till now, Harvey has been weak. He's been afraid. Always depending on everyone else to save him. Like a child. Stop it! Now you see. These aren't your friends. And they aren't going to help you. This is like uh, the symbiote and Spider-Man. All right, now you've got two seconds. Or what? Harvey won't be pushed around anymore. No, he's going to make them pay. Everyone who thought they could hurt him and get away with it. Starting with you. Both of you! You're gonna pick that up. Who oh, am I? Yes. Bring it on, bitch! Alright, fine. You wanna fight? Let's go. One even on me. Good! Jesus, Harvey. Of course. Gotta be fair about this. Can't play favorites. They both deserve it. One way or another. <sighs> How about we flip for it? This isn't funny. No. No. Do you remember the uh, the safe game we have where where you played? Um, how he got hit with the with the light and his face got ruined. Imagine the scene right now. It really isn't. Oh, 
Selena, looks like you're first. Yeah, always getting in the middle of things. Stay the hell away from me. The call's already been made. Harvey. <laughs> Bruce. Fucking schizophrenic. No, I don't want to hurt you. This isn't. They turned their backs on you. Harvey, put the knife down. <sighs> Selena. <sighs> He's gonna hurt someone. You know we can take him out. Have you lost your mind? <laughs> no. Fuck Last you. Last warning, Harvey. You walk out that door right now and I don't have to hurt you. No going back now. We say here. Finally In your face. Your true colors, huh? Nice spinning bike fist. Not with him. But okay, that's what I wanted to say. You're not alone, you have him. But I can't. Oh god, I can't listen to him. Who are you talking about? There's no one else here. That's it's no one. It's just me. My fault. Kill him. Harvey, don't. Bruce, I I don't think we can help him. Not on our own. It's just me. It's just me. It's just me. It's just me. He's my friend, Selena. I'm not going to abandon him. He needs professional help. Help you can't give him. It's okay, Bruce. I'll go. I don't deserve your help. Go off with your tail between your legs. I'm sorry. So sorry. Harvey. He's not a bad computer between the, the takeout so food. for this place. I'm not gonna stick around and wait for him to come back. I thought it would be a while before I had to move again. You're just gonna take off. Where will you go? I don't know. Not a lot of apartments in Gotham with this kind of private access. Ugh. Maybe I'll live on a boat. Can live in my pants? Kidding. But without that pussy, yeah. please. That means you too. We won't go far. Don't worry. You should come stay with me. Uh, I don't know. There's plenty of space. Alfred could set up a guest room for you. Think about it. It's Harvey. Great. Oh, maybe. What was that about? I'm supposed to announce my resignation at a press event today. Somehow try to appear happy that Oswald Cobblepot is taking my job. No job. Sounds like an opportunity. How do you mean? They screwed you out of your own company. You have all this information that could bring them down, and they're handing you a live mic. So use it. Don't be their puppet. Maybe you're right. This could be my chance to expose Oswald for who he really is. Let Gotham know he's a part of the children of Arkham. Exactly. Hey, you better get going. I've got some packing to do. You missed the party, the offer I would still say. stands. Sounding better and better by the minute. I just don't want any STDs. I'm sorry. I'm 
I'm sorry about all this, Bruce. We've... Uh, we've prepared a brief damage control statement to make this easier. After I introduce you, all you'll have to do is read what's on the teleprompter. And then I can take it from there. Got my little coronation speech just waiting. And please, Bruce, try to be on your best behavior. The oh, very best. Behavior. Wouldn't want to bring any more shame to the Wayne family name, now would we? I know it's unfair to ask this of you, but please. Right now, your reputation, your entire legacy, depends on your cooperation. Get through today, and I can help you. I can convince the board to bring you back. It might not be CEO, oh, but it will be something. A step to regaining what you're being forced to give up. Of course, Regina. That's copperhead. Whatever I can do to help. That's yeah, that good, copper Bruce. Thing is copperhead. Trust us to sort this all out. Maybe it's copperhead. Everything will be fine. But copperhead Bruce, was achieved. Bruce, what's your opinion of the Shiner? Regina wanted me to cover it up with makeup. She doesn't think it looks very dignified. But here, I think it's a fine display of what the moral high ground looks like. Mr. Cobblepot. All in good fun, honestly. <laughs> a thrown punch is just water under the bridge. Right, Bruce? Boys are just being boys and all of that. No hurt feelings, I'm sure. Bruce just didn't like losing the office. It's not the black eye that makes you undignified, Oz. Hey, will you two please stop this? You're both professionals. It's time. Bruce, I'm going to introduce you and then you're on. Please, stick to the teleprompter. Red him out, red him out. Good morning, everyone, and thank you for being here. Wayne Enterprises has always taken its role in the community very seriously. Isn't it funny and we've all how everything I said to you in the park has come true? Me, and taking everything that's yours, and that's not even a punchline. Oh no, dear heart, not even close. We have no one's gonna follow you around and take pictures now. It'd almost be sad. If you were so bloody handsome. The children of Arkham handed you this crew, Oswald. You didn't earn any of it. Who As cares? It never really matters how a king comes to sit on his throne, like Bruce. The only thing that matters is that it's his bum warm in the chair. This is just a first step towards making things right. Soon enough, it'll be Cobblepot Industries, Cobblepot Medical, and Cobblepot Tech on tops of buildings, and you, Waynes, will be what you should have been all along. A forgotten footnote. Cobblepot will come to mean the future of Gotham, and Wayne will be a story no one wants to hear. That is not going to happen. Oh, don't be a sore loser, Bruce. It doesn't look nice on you. Oh, I forgot to mention, I did some digging, and you know how old Hill admitted he had your mom and dad killed? I found out why he did it. Oh, yeah, and I'll tell you the story, but only if you say, pretty please. It's quite the page, Turner. I'm sure you're just dying to hear it. I don't need to know why. Hill had them killed, that's all that matters. Well, I certainly didn't expect that. But suit yourself. Now you'll never know what part your mum played in it. And now, Fuck Bruce you. Wayne would like to say a few words. Remember, enjoy yourself, Bruce. After all, you never know how much time you really have left. I've been asked here today to lie to you, to regurgitate a script prepared by the company, all to hide the fact that I have been forced out. But I won't do that. I will not lie to save face. One moment, folks. Try that again, and I'll call security. I know what my father did. I know how much he hurt you. But I am nothing like him. His actions are his own. Stop trying to save face.
Unfortunately, the board is more concerned with good PR than they are with actual solutions. They don't care about making things right. They only care about what looks good. What are you doing? Thinks he's being cute is what he's doing. Security! Step back, Mr. Wayne. Oh, that was quite a show you put on, Bruce. <clears throat> My apologies. Shoot! Please forgive me, Mr. Wayne. Everyone. I, for one, completely understand his behavior today. Nice After statement. All, the press seemed to eat it up. I rather enjoyed it myself. Not that it'll change anything. We can talk about it later. Later? No. This needs to happen right now. Uh, I guess I should have switched between the, the answers. To, to have the chance to rat out Cobblepot. Drop your pen. That's not... I should know... Fucking whore, I knew it! You feel that? That's the drug taking hold of you. You? You're with the children of Arkham. No, I am the children of Arkham. What's the guy? She did. I think it's time you knew my real name. Fuck you! I am Lady Arkham. That was zero boobs! Look at him up there! Taking everything that should belong to you. Mocking you, the smug, insignificant bastard. Fuck you! He thinks he can get away with it. Because none that whole, of them my first know guess? who he really is. They wouldn't believe you if you told them. And then the fuck I had zero tits. And if we could just get one more round of applause for our friend, the man of the hour, Bruce Wayne! <laughs> Ouch, someone's a little touchy, it seems. It would be so easy to get rid of him. Who else will deliver justice? And before she is, she's being played. Fuck it. Fuck, 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 fuck it. It is Alfred, it's not Albert. My life. Fucking cliffhanger! After his shocking and atrocious display of violence towards Oswald Cobblepot and members of the press, Bruce Wayne has demonstrated a clear lack of mental stability. That's why, effective immediately, I have signed the order to have him hospitalized in Arkham Asylum. Even with Batman as its protector, Gotham already has enough deranged criminals on its streets. I believe that Gotham's citizens deserve to be safe. That they deserve to be protected. Even if that means I have to do it myself. I, I already bought the full with game. With the children of Arkham out in full force, we need him now more than ever. Where is Batman? Well, it's like 10 bucks, so it's okay. Fuck it. Fuck, 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 bye! Good night. Don't touch yourself or you're gonna get blind. <laughs>